Good morning everyone. Today we are going to read about Little Red Riding Hood. But before that, I want to introduce myself. My name is Safara Marie G. Anulaw, Grade 1, Section Jasmine. My teacher is Teacher Minda Flor Delis from elementary school, Bagong Silangan. But before that, I'm gonna show you this picture of my book. As you can see, there's lots of flowers. And of course, there's a very beautiful house. And there's flowers over there. And there's a rainbow. See? And there she is. She is a little red riding hood. Can, can you see? She is a red she is wearing red hood. Now let's start reading. Little red riding hood. There was a little girl who was always wearing a red hood. So everyone called her Little Red Riding Hood. Little Red Riding Hood would visit, visit her grandmother. Her mother gave her a basket of goodies as a present. On her way to her grandmother's house, she met a wolf. The wolf was so pleasant. Little Red Riding Hood easily made friends with him. I am going to visit my grandma, she told him. You can take that shortcut road to her house. The wolf pointed and the, at the pot at the road where, where he had come from. Then the wolf ran as fast as he could to grandma's house. The wolf tied the old woman and hid her. Little Red Riding Hood took the hand for of the old woman to ask for blessing. You got very big arms. Grandma, she cried. You also got big eyes. Your teeth are also big. The, fr the frightened girl said, Little Red Riding Hood suddenly jumped out of bed. The wolf drew the bed covers and leaped out of bed. You can't, you can't run away from me, he said. Passing woodcutter arrived just in time. Before the wolf couldn't go up Little Red Riding Hood. Little Red Riding Hood was back in her mother's arms. She promised never to be befriend a wolf again. 